Hello students, welcome to EPG Patshala. I am Dr. Sudhita Gautam Parehar from Hansraj College, University of Delhi. Today, we are going to discuss about a module, Tryptophan Operon, under paper, Molecular Genetics. Learning Outcomes, How do Prokaryotes Grow, Metabolize and Reproduce? What is the genetic regulatory mechanism in prokaryotes and bacterial viruses? A operon concept, assembly line of operon system. Why are functionally related genes regulated together? What are the promoter and operator repressor interactions within an operon? Operon concept. Introduction, the genetic regulatory system of a gene cluster which shares the regulatory elements, promoter and repressor is referred to as an operon. It is present in the prokaryotes and bacteriophages. An operon usually consists of a gene regulator, promoter, operator and a number of structural genes that code for a specific protein. The term operon was coined by Monad and Jacob in 1960 and it was first mentioned in the proceedings of the French Academy of Sciences. Operon concept is a basic mechanism of controlling the gene expression in bacterial cells. In 1985, Monod and Jacob received Nobel Prize for their work. The regulation takes place at the transcription level. In this case, the cells are themselves capable of adjusting the production level of certain enzymes involved in gene expression during transcription. For example, if we consider the availability of an amino acid, say tryptophan, the cell regulates its production by manipulating the enzyme activities which are involved in the switching on and off of tryptophan production depending upon its level in the cell. In other words, the genes of the bacterial genome respond to the changes in the metabolic status of the cell. Tryptophan operon, also known as TRP operon, synthesizes amino acid tryptophan and consists of a multi-step pathway. The tryptophan operon consists of five genes which are involved in the biosynthesis of amino acid tryptophan or TRP from chorismate. The bacterial chromosome is a large circular molecule of DNA, thus the genes of operon are arranged in a linear manner at a specific location. Operon's gene regulatory models in prokaryotes and bacteriophages. Major components of operons a promoter responsible for initiation of transcription an operator which is a DNA sequence and acts to turn on and off the operon, genes encoding the metabolic enzymes, a repressor or an activator. Operon is regulated by repressors or activators in response to environment. Operon concept, group of genes that are transcribed at the same time or together are known as operons. Expression of 
operon is usually controlled by an important biochemical process. Operons are present only in prokaryotes. Operon concept was proposed in 1961 by Francosus Jacob and Jacques Munat at the Pasteur Institute in Paris based on their studies on the lac genes of the bacterium E. coli and the genes of bacteriophage lambda. The tryptophan or TRP operon consists of five structural genes which code for enzymes involved in the tryptophan biosynthesis. A TRP promoter and a TRP operator sequence. Each step in the pathway is catalyzed by a specific enzyme. All the enzymes are clustered together on a single bacterial chromosome. A single promoter is responsible for the activation of all five enzymes which together constitute a transcription unit. On transcription, a single mRNA molecule is obtained which codes for all the five polypeptides constituting the individual enzymes which are required in the tryptophan biosynthesis pathway. Operon model structure and relation to gene regulation. Operon is actually an assembly line system where each component has its own specific role and the sole purpose of entire unit is to transcribe the required gene so that the appropriate proteins are made available to the cell. Promoter is the start switch of the unit for any gene transcription. It requires the RNA polymerase enzyme. In simple terms, it is usually a sequence of DNA at the beginning of operon to which the RNA polymerase enzyme can bind. Binding of the RNA polymerase enzyme initiates the production of proteins. As the name suggests, operator is the decision maker whether the gene should be transcribed or not depending on the requirement of the cell for the specific protein which is coded by the gene of interest. If the protein is present in the cell, operator stops the further production of protein down the assembly line. Whereas, if 
the cell lacks the protein it signals the promoter to begin the production of the protein as per the requirement of the cell the operon produces tryptophan when an rna polymerase enzyme binds to the promoter and transcribes the gene of the operon when the levels of tryptophan diminish a trp repressor protein encoded by a separate operon is produced which forms a dimer dimer form of the repressor is inactive or unable to bind the trp operator and thus the production of tryptophan continues as the structural genes of the trp operon are transcribed however when tryptophan is present in the cell there is no need for the expression of the structural genes and they are turned off this switching off of the genes is achieved when the tryptophan binds to the trp repressor to activate it activated repressor molecule is capable to bind with the operator and stop transcription of the structural genes this is referred to as negative regulation and the tryptophan molecule is known as co repressor metabolic control of tryptophan production by its own levels within the cell the operon is activated when ever the levels of tryptophan are low within the cell a single promoter ensures that the whole cluster of functionally related genes is well coordinated with a single on off switch thus the bacterial cell is fully capable of making tryptophan amino acid on its own even if the culture medium lacks tryptophan due to the presence of all enzymes necessary for the metabolic biosynthetic pathway the switch which controls the operon initiation is referred to as an operator or the controlling site which is a segment of dna placed within the promoter or in some cases between the promoter and the enzyme coding genes this operon switch is controlled by a protein called the trp repressor which is capable to 
स्विच ऑफ द ओपरॉन इफ ट्रिप्टोफैन इज अक्यूमुलेटिंग इन द सेल मोर एंड मोर टी आर पी रिप्रेसर मॉलिक्यूल्स आर एक्टिवेटेड विच कैन बाइंड टू द टी आर पी ऑपरेटर एंड शट डाउन द प्रोडक्शन ऑफ ट्रिप्टोफैन बायोसिंथेटिक एंजाइम्स बट इफ द लेवल्स आर लो द ट्रांसक्रिप्शन ऑफ द ट्रिप्टोफैन जीन्स इज रिज्यूम्ड ट्रिप्टोफैन ओपरॉन प्रेजेंट्स एन एग्जाम्पल ऑफ हाउ द चेंजेस इन द सेल्स इंटरनल एंड एक्सटर्नल एनवायरमेंट आर एबल टू रेगुलेट द जीन एक्सप्रेशन रेगुलेशन ऑफ द मेटाबॉलिक पाथवे वेन द लेवल्स ऑफ ट्रिप्टोफैन आर हाई इन द सेल फर्स्ट इनिबिशन ऑफ एंजाइम बाय अ फीडबैक मेकेनिज्म एंड सेकेंड द एक्सप्रेशन इज रिप्रेस्ड टू रेगुलेट द एक्टिविटी ऑफ एंजाइम्स ट्रांसलेशन इज केपेबल ऑफ प्रोड्यूसिंग ऑल द फाइव एंजाइम्स बिकॉज ईच पॉली peptide produced from transcription has its own start and stop codon to differentiate the various enzymes operators play an extra role of regulation by attenuation in the case of tryptophan operon the operon is transcribed only when tryptophan is low and utilizes a single promoter metabolic controls has two mechanisms a or the first one is enzymes activity is regulated by the end product itself that is it shows feedback inhibition second or b is production of enzymes regulated by the levels of tryptophan within the cells thus the expression of various genes are dependent on the metabolic status of the cell attenuation of the tryptophan operon tryptophan or trp operon is also regulated through a second mechanism that is attenuation attenuation was first reported by charles yanovsky and his colleagues in early 1970s they observed that repression of the operator site was not the mode of trp operon regulation they identified a series of mutants with high levels of tryptophan but the operator site was not up was unaffected thus they concluded that another mechanism besides repression at the operator site was controlling the process of transcription they were able to reveal the presence of two messenger rnas of different sizes which were transcribed from the trp operon first a longer messenger rna containing the entire sequence of five structural genes and a shorter messenger rna of 140 nucleotides 
Further studies revealed the presence of a region corresponding to the long 5-UTR of the messenger RNA transcribed from the tryptophan operon. This 5-UTR also known as the leader sequence was present upstream of the coding region of the TRPE structural gene. The leader sequence is responsible for fine tuning of the TRP operon genes within the cell depending upon the levels of tryptophan. The leader sequence contains four regions numbered 1 to 4. Region 1 is complementary to region 2 and region 2 is complementary to region 3. The region 3 is complementary to the region 4. The complementary base pairing takes place between 1 and 2, 2 and 3 and they form hairpin loops. Attenuation is helpful in bacteria because the ribosome attach to the messenger RNA as it is being translated. That is, the translation begins even before the transcription of the whole messenger RNA is completed. Attenuation of the TRP or tryptophan operon when the levels of tryptophan are high. In high levels of tryptophan, ribosome binds to TRP polycystronic messenger RNA and begins the translation of the leader sequence. The stop codons lie in between the sequence 1 and 2. During translation, the ribosome follows the RNA polymerase very closely and synthesizes the leader sequence as a result, terminating the translation of structural genes. The base pairing is prevented between the region 1 and region 2 of the leader sequence and the base pairing is facilitated between the region 3 and region 4 to form a region 3 region 4 stem loop which acts as a transcription terminator. Thus, in presence of tryptophan, its synthesis is prevented. Attenuation of the tryptophan operon when the levels of tryptophan are low. However, when the tryptophan levels are low, the ribosome pauses at the two TRP codons contained within the region 1. This leaves the region 2 to base pair with region 3 to form region 2, region 3 stem loop referred to as an anti-termination loop. Anti-termination loop prevents the formation of termination loop and transcription continues along the entire length of mRNA. Regulation of the tryptophan operon 
true attenuation depends upon the precise timings and interaction of the simultaneous processes of transcription and translation of the tryptophan structural genes attenuation versus repression overall expression of the tryptophan operon in e coli is regulated by the combined action of repression and attenuation intracellular concentration of the tryptophan regulates transcription initiation through repression however attenuation regulates transcription termination by fine tuning the transcription process the cell utilizes both attenuation and repression to regulate transcription in response to different degrees of tryptophan deprivation so students let us summarize what we have learned from this module prokaryotic gene regulatory system is referred to as an operon an operon usually consists of a gene regulator promoter operator and a number of structural genes that code for a specific protein the operon concept was proposed in 1961 by francosus jacob and jacques monod at the pasteur institute in paris based on their studies on the lac genes of the bacterium e coli and the genes of bacteriophage lambda promoter is the start switch of the operon unit for any gene transcription it requires rna polymerase enzyme binding of the rna polymerase enzyme initiates the production of proteins operator stops the further production of protein if it is available in the cell whereas if the cell lacks the protein operator signals the promoter to begin the production of the protein tryptophan or trp operon consists of five genes which are involved in the biosynthesis of amino acid tryptophan from chorus mate metabolic controls first the enzyme activity is regulated by the end product itself that is it shows a negative feedback inhibition second production of enzyme is regulated by the levels of tryptophan within the cell thus the expression of various genes are dependent on the metabolic status of the cell the operon is activated whenever the levels of tryptophan are low within the cell operator or the controlling site is controlled by a protein called the trp repressor which is capable to switch off the operon when the levels of tryptophan diminish a trp repressor protein encoded by a separate operon is produced which forms a dimer the dimer form of the repressor is inactive and unable to bind the trp operator and thus the production of tryptophan continues as the structural genes of the trp operon are transcribed activated repressor is capable 
to bind with the operator and stop the transcription of the structural genes. This is referred to as a negative regulation and the tryptophan molecule is known as co-repressor. TRP operon is also regulated through a second mechanism that is attenuation which was first reported by Charles Yanofsky and his colleagues in 1970s. They revealed the presence of two mRNAs of different sizes which were transcribed from the TRP operon. First, a longer messenger RNA containing the entire sequence of five structural genes and a much shorter messenger RNA of 140 nucleotides. The leader sequence is responsible for fine tuning of the TRP operon genes within the cell depending upon the levels of tryptophan and consists of four regions numbered from 1 to 4 and the region 1 is complementary to region 2, the region 2 is complementary to 3 and region 3 is complementary to region 4. During translation, the ribosome follows the DNA polymerase very closely and synthesizes the leader sequence. As a result, terminating the translation of structural genes, the base pairing is prevented between the region 1 and 2 and facilitated between the region 3 and 4 to form a region 3, region 4 stem loop which acts as a transcription terminator. Regulation of the TRP operon through attenuation depends upon the precise timings and interaction of the simultaneous processes of transcription and translation of the TRP structural genes. The cell utilizes both attenuation and repression to regulate transcription in response to different degrees of tryptophan deprivation. Thank you.